Hey guys, so is Aaron Judge returning to the Yankees? We have no official word. We have no, we have really don't have anything in regards to, hey, breaking news, Judge is back. But we do have a very reputable source, a very reputable man in the baseball world who believes that Mr. Aaron Judge will be returning to the Yankees. And we're going to get into that in a little bit. But before we do, if you guys enjoy the video and you love the Yankees and you like this kind of content, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. We're on the road to 8,000, 8,000. So let's get there, ladies and gentlemen. And I appreciate all the support as of late. It means a lot. All right. Somebody very reputable in the baseball industry believes that Mr. Aaron Judge will inevitably return to the New York Yankees. Let's check out what Mr. Jeff Passan had to say on the Michael K show. I will be reading this off of the Michigan Yankees Twitter account. If you guys don't follow him, I highly recommend that you do. Let's take a look. I think the Yankees have the greatest incentive of any team to bring back Aaron Judge. They are a flawed baseball team, even with Judge. Without Aaron Judge, they are nowhere close to what they can be. The Yankees will have the biggest offer on the table when it's all said and done. It reminds me of Garrett Cole. When the Yankees really want someone, they go and get them. I just think there are certain cases where the Yankees act like the Yankees. The Giants have never signed a guy over $200 million. Well, if Jeff Passan thinks so, I think so. No, seriously. The Yankees, in, in, at this point, Aaron Judge made them a boatload of money last year. And that also had a lot to do with the home run chase, of course. But they also know that they're, near, they're not nearly as good without him. Just like what Mr. Passon said. Now, in regards to the Giants really never spending not even over $200 million for somebody. Have to think about it this way, too. Aaron Judge might, might be the exception for them. He very well might be. Look what he did last year. He's a Bay Area boy. He's from the West Coast. Will he go to a better organization? Will he go to an organization that will consistently put a team around him to win? I'm not entirely sure about that. I mentioned this in previous videos. The Giants won 107 games in 2021. They won 81 games last year. Finished 500. What a friggin' drop that was. So if you add Aaron Judge, maybe he had what? He had a 10 war, Judgey? Maybe Judge gets them to 91 wins. Is that worth it? Could be. Could be worth it. But is it worth $400 million? Is it worth $400 million to them? $350, $300 million even to them. And then to not put other pieces around them because you have it all tied up into one guy. I'm not sure. And like I've said recently too, the Giants do would rather allocate their funds instead of investing it into one dude. Well, Judge just met with the Giants, and apparently the meeting went very well. I hope he comes back, but that remains to be seen. He has to meet with LA too. I don't think he goes there though, for the simple fact he grew up a Giants fan. Money's money, I understand that. But if he loves the Giants as much as he does, can he really see himself playing for the Dodgers? And if the Yankees are going to outbid them, could he really see himself playing for the freaking Dodgers? I don't think so. We should see what the heck happens. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Hit that like button. We just launched channel memberships. Well, actually a month ago by now. The links to that will be down in the description. Also, if you're watching this on Thanksgiving, happy Thanksgiving. Happy Turkey Day. Holiday season is in gear, baby! Let's get a rock and a rollin' for that! I love the holiday season. It's my favorite time of year. So let's go! All right, guys. Hopefully, Aaron Judge returning to the Yankees is our nice little Christmas gift for 20 to wrap up 2022. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching. This is Joe. Until next time, signing out.